<laughs> yeah, this one needs some work. Um, let's clean this up and make it pretty. Oh wow, that's loaded. Where is it? Is it just riveted? Oh, it's riveted. Oh, it stink. Someone took the bolt off. This is going to be more fun than I thought. Oh, nice. Snapped off the tip of the razor blade. Into that sucker over. We're gonna have to clean that off. That's gonna be fun. Bunch of little pieces in here. Look at that. I didn't even think that was. There. Caught it. That one is on there. It is out. That's happy. Yeah. 
scratch that. Let's use the devil's tool. Self etching. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's seven of them in that hole. On there. And then the shaft. And it rolls on those. Ooh, that was easy. This holds that on. There we go. So now, look at that. And that cranks that down. Ah, screw goes in the little hole, the little screw in the little hole. That holds the whole thing together. And look at that, jaws come out just like it's supposed to.
So there you have it, a Miller Falls egg beater drill. This is one of my, my favorite restorations. I, I, anytime I get to restore an egg beater drill, they're just incredibly fun. They're, they're simple, they're easy to restore, the mechanical parts in them, um, they, they're just, they're, they're an all around fun tool. And when you get it up and done and it looks good, I'm, I'm just very happy. Originally it would have been painted red and black, but I decided to do black and blue because it's my favorite shop colors. Um, and I'm really happy with how it came out. It's a really smooth running drill now. Now this is one of the, the cheaper models that they made because it had this retention screw that actually holds it down against the gear. Um, the better ones actually had a second gear back here holding up the backside to balance it. Um, but this one works phenomenally well. And I'm probably gonna be selling this one soon. If you haven't been to the Can I Have It Facebook group, uh, I'll try and leave a link to it down below. Uh, but they have an auction every weekend where people can go and, and list things that they have. It's one of the best places right now that the MWTCA meets aren't happening. Um, and I'm usually buying something on there once a week and I, I usually sell something on there once a week. Um, so every weekend there's an auction and this will probably be popping up on that auction here soon. So if you'd like to own this one, um, stay tuned. You might see it popping up there. So I think that'll about do it for today. This has been a really fun one and uh, yeah, this is just enjoyable. <laughs> If you do have any questions, comments, ideas, let me know those down in the comments below. I do read through all of them and I often learn a lot of things. People say, well, why didn't you do it that way? It's like, well, I didn't think about that. So if you have any ideas like that, let me know those down below. I am looking forward to reading through all of them. So on that note, I do want to say thank you to the patrons on Patreon, members here on the channel, everyone scrolling over here on the side and people who've clicked that join button down there. You are literally the reason that this channel is here. And I know I say that every week, but I am incredibly thankful for you because without you, we wouldn't be here. I, a lot of other channels have sponsors where they're talking about some particular game that's on, on the uh, phone, but I don't want to do that. I want to actually talk about what you guys want and I want you to be able to sponsor the channel. So if you like this, think about becoming a member or a patron. But I think that'll about do it for today. And until next time, have a wonderful day. Drill, egg beater, crank. Ooh, um, uh, um, my wife always complains when I use an egg beater drill. She just says I'm, I'm very cranky.